We are back now to do our design uh, of this electrical system. Uh, we're going to put in a new EV charger inside of Conduit. So previously we did a site walk, uh, which was a form we filled out that added these pieces of equipment. Uh, then we converted that to a Conduit project um, where we got to this single line diagram. Uh, and in the last video, we connected the switchboard to uh, panel PP1 down there, as well as the utility upstream, and then put in the raceway information. Uh, and you can see that we've got all the information we need in here to do um, uh, load analysis because we've got all of our check marks and there's no red lines anywhere. So we know we have everything we need. So the next thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna hit this dot, dot, dot button up here on top. Oops. Hit this dot, dot, dot button. It's our, our options page. Uh, like I said so far, we have been in collection. We've been in collection mode. We're gonna move over to design mode next. I'm gonna hit design. And what that's gonna do is it's gonna gray out all of our uh, all of our stuff. So um, now we have um, all this um, existing equipment is grayed out. Uh, and when we add new equipment, that equipment is going to show up as a dark line because it's going to be new equipment. So I'm going to tap, we can still interact with everything. So I'm going to tap on panel PP1 here. I'm going to hit add equipment below. From here, uh, here's all the equipment we have inside of Conduit. We've got generators and meters, DC, AC inverters, because we've got some folks doing some uh, some solar work. Uh, we've got switchboards, panels, transfer switches, transformers, uh, all that kind of stuff, VFDs, motors, a generic load that you can add, you know, just name it whatever you want and set an amperage. Uh, but what we're going to do is we're going to hit this EV charger here. And we're going to name it, uh, say for instance, new EV. Uh, we're going to say the location is in the parking lot. Um, we'll put in, uh, you know, a model number of some kind, whatever it may be. Um, and then we can put in a trip rating here in a moment. But right here, we're going to make sure that we uh, put all this information in. I'm going to um, see a load analysis here to make sure we get all the right information. So I'm going to tap on this piece of equipment. We can say that it is a level two. We can say the manufacturer's, for instance, charge point. Uh, if we have a model number, we can put it in here and we can set an amperage. We'll say that this is a 30 amp um, piece of equipment here. Uh, if you want to, you can also tap on it and put that in manually um, with your numbers pad down here. Uh, we'll say it's just a 30 amp. Uh, and then we're going to tap on this raceway. We're going to say that this is PVC, say inch and a half PVC and 50 feet long. We're going to add five conductors, say they are copper, and we're going to say they're number eight. So we've got an uh, inch and a half PVC with copper, five conductors, number eight in there. It's going to label that for us. And finally, let's put in a three pole, say um, 40 amp breaker in there. So now we've got this level two new EV charger inside of our existing um, infrastructure here. Are kind of weird. Um, so we've got our existing um, infrastructure and we put in this new um, 40 amp three pole breaker, um, a uh, raceway out to a new EV charger out there. And if we wanted to, we could even duplicate this. Maybe duplicate and it's going to draw us a new one with a new 40 amp breaker inside of panel PP1. Uh, and we'll keep doing that. We can duplicate this again. It's just going to keep on drawing us uh, new. Um, new EVs in here. So we've got all of our new EVs out here. Next thing we can do is tap on this piece of equipment and we can hit analyze load. Now what this is going to do is it's going to check load calculations upstream. We're missing a couple of voltages in here. We're going to push on anyway. So what we're looking at right here is um, at uh, the bottom down here we've got our new EV copy down here. Uh, you can see there's a 30 amp proposed load. What we're doing here is we're looking upstream and we're saying okay uh, what is our um, proposed load 30 amps does that fit on the raceway upstream yes it does does it fit on the breaker that you're attached to yes it does because it's a 40 amp breaker does it fit on the raceway above that yes it does and so on and so on all the way back up to the utility connection so here we've got our um, oops this. got our new infrastructure built uh, and so the next piece is going to be um, doing some exports. So in here, we can do a few different exports. I'm going to show you what they look like. Um, I'm going to do the uh, single line diagram first. Now, this is just a 24 by 36 uh, single line diagram. Um, it's got all of your existing and new infrastructure on there. Uh, this can be exported and sent to uh, a plotter, or you can um, um, export it uh, and put it into AutoCAD as well. Uh, it's going to be dumb lines when it gets into AutoCAD, but it will go into AutoCAD. 
Um, below that, we've also got um, a bill of materials. So this bill of materials, I'm going to do a PDF, but we also do it as a JSON and a CSV. What this is going to do is it's going to list all the new equipment, the new design that we put in here, and list the, how much raceway we need, the specifications on that raceway, the amount of number eight, for instance. We need 750 feet because we've got five um, conductors in each one of those pipes. Um, uh, we need three 40 amp breakers, uh, and we need three charge point 30 amp um, chargers. So um, you can take this and send it directly to your um, distributor. Uh, and then finally, we've got this thing called a design proposal. Now, what this is going to do, it's going to take everything, all of our photos, all of our information here, and it's going to build this PDF that is a design proposal for the CV charger installations. We've got our site plan here. Uh, we've got our as-built infrastructure that we put in before. And then we've got our propo proposed infrastructure, which are these th three new EVs along with a, um, uh, our existing stuff. Uh, and then down here, we've got all of our site photos that we put on the site walk that was in the first video. Um, along with our raceway um, information um, and, uh, and all that good stuff. So it's got kind of everything on here that is about this, this kind of site proposal, this demo project. Uh, and like I said before, let me go back in here. Um, when you're in here, you can send this immediately out of the app. Um, either a text message, a Gmail, you can airdrop it to somebody. Uh, but that allows you to share it uh, almost immediately. So that is Conduits. Um, um, would love to uh, get your feedback um, and um, let's talk soon. Uh, get on a get on a real world demo uh, on a Zoom call or in person. Thank you.